What's up everybody? It is the best bot Kid Smooth and we are going to react to this brand new Red Dead Redemption official gameplay video. Have not seen it. It's two minutes after 11 o'clock. I know they just published it so let's hit the play button and let's see what's going on with this trailer. I wonder if I'll be hyped because I haven't really been hyped for this game but we shall find out. <laughs> <laughs> They'll probably hang you, buddy. <laughs> you coming, buddy? In the late 1800s, America was evolving, on its way to becoming the most powerful country in the world. New immigrants arrived, thriving outposts became towns, and civilization was spreading rapidly wow. into the huge, wild, and lawless frontier. With Red Dead Redemption 2, Rockstar Games aims to create a living world that's not simply open, but deeper. Hey, come on, pretty boy. More interactive and detailed than ever. Pretty boy? Kid. Combining action, storytelling, we need to get those people warm and fed, and gameplay in new ways. As you live, ride, and fight to survive, Okay. As an outlaw in a notorious gang. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. Let's go. So far looking good. So far looking good. The game is an attempt to capture this pivotal moment when the age of outlaws was ending and the modern world was born. There is a huge world to explore, set across a range of America's heartland and frontier. Yeah. From harsh mountain trails and dense forests to untamed swamplands and sweeping deserts, rugged livestock towns to modernizing cities and much more. All populated with a diverse cast of characters from turn of the century life. Now shoo, please. I'm waiting for someone interesting to turn up. Okay. You play as Arthur Morgan, a trusted senior gun in the Vanderling gang. A band of outlaws and outcasts on the run from the pressures of civilized life. We are gonna borrow a little money from old Uncle Sam and be out of his hair once and for all. Each time they are forced to flee an area, the gang sets up a camp as a base. This is where gang members eat, sleep, perform chores, play games, and share stories. Anyway, I got caught by some to a lot country uh, chef stealing a chicken, I think it was. And he decided I was going to be hanged for it. These are the people Arthur calls family. And you will get to know each gang member over the course of the game. So, you save the silly bastard's life, then you and him go robbing sheep. Helping the camp with food and supplies will keep morale high, it's while spending time with other gang members can reveal new secrets, fun things to do, and opportunities for mischief. How about you and me go and redistribute some property? In and out of camp, the world is alive and responds to the player. Well, ain't this game. a rare treat? Fun and your guns aren't the only way to interact with the environment. <laughs> Call out to a passing rider. That's a nice horse. Talk yourself into trouble with a local tough guy. Clear out. Or out of trouble with a town sheriff. Or intimidate a witness into silence and more. Keep your mouth shut. You're dead, friend. You don't want to involve yourself with this. Confrontations can be escalated or diffused. Take it easy. Do what you want. I don't care. You can form friendships. God, you did it. Or make enemies as you choose. You killed my cousin, you sick son of a bitch. Your actions have consequences, and it's up to you to decide just how honorable Arthur is. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? <laughs> Shooting and fighting have both been radically improved to make combat deep and engaging at all times. Each weapon has unique characteristics with realistic reload and recoil that always keeps the player grounded and connected to the action in a gunfight. Wow. It should look kind of lit. In a similar way, the bond with your horse is crucial and changes based on your treatment of the animal. Hold still, girl. Some breeds are better suited for certain tasks. I got a fella been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. Your saddle and saddlebags can store extra weapons, along with supplies and animal carcasses that you pick up while out roaming or hunting. 
Over time, the bond between you and your horse will grow, making them easier to control in tense situations. Yeah, he's a great horse, aside from when the devil got him. A rich and varied ecosystem thrives in the world, full of predators, prey, and scavengers. All smart and sometimes deadly. You want to yeah. come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Hunting helps the camp or earns you money. Wound an animal and you'll have to track them down. Animal pelts and other items you find can be traded for cash to use at general stores, gunsmiths, saloons, and elsewhere. This is God's own country, and I feel I'm in purgatory. This is a world that is rich in depth and detail. All designed to be explored on horseback or on foot. As you live the fateful journey of a gang of outlaws on the run across America. Yeah. In the next gameplay video, we'll look at missions, activities, Whew. enemy gangs, robberies, other things to do, and much more, including the evolution of sharpshooting using the Deadeye system. Damn. That, that like cheese, but whoo! Okay, I think I'm a, I think I'm a bit sold. I think I'm a bit sold. What, like that, that was a uh, pretty dope. So apparently that game looks like it was running on a PS4 uh, per se a pro. Um, and some of the um, shots from, I don't know, unless it's my monitor, it looked like there was like some shimmying going on in some of the pants. Um, I'm trying to see if I can fast forward uh, to where it was. But like in the material, it just, you seen like a lot of like noise there. But um, beyond that, that looks epic. It looks epic. It looks epic. And um, comes out October, I mean, it took this freaking long to get gameplay but wow like i almost don't actually this video is actually available on 4k if you watch the raw feed on youtube um it's like i only really need four games for the the remainder of the year like in red dead is one of them so i have my my tomb raider red dead Forza, NBA Live, right, five, uh, and I'll throw and I'll throw in Spider Man Live, Forza, uh, Tomb Raider, uh, Red Dead. For, oh no, in Assassin's Damn, that's actually between Red Dead, Tomb Raider is probably going to be the shortest of them all. But between Red Dead and Assassin's Creed Odyssey, like that's whew, like I I understand why a lot of these uh, titles. Uh, like a lot of these games, publishers move their games. Like between the battlefields and the Call of Duties, mm -mm. it's just not happening. It's not happening. That was lit. I'm looking forward to the next trailer, and I'm actually, I actually now feel comfortable pre-ordering Red Dead Redemption 2. So let me know what you guys thought of this trailer, the first gameplay reveal. Sure, it doesn't look as superb as those uh, those previous cutscene trailers they were showing us and whatnot, but it does look really, really good. Um, like the character models, the, the environment, uh, the graphics, everything just looked pretty freaking uh, dope here. It's just like, even the, the fighting system, I hope that what they did with the game is that you don't have to over rely on shooting and that the combat, the combat is decent enough for you to to go you know what i'm just gonna go in brawling this time and i'm sure that's probably not going to be the case but if i can rely on brawling uh versus shooting all the time that would be great now this looks like it's going to be a super big world and um the thing is they said they made it easy so you can travel on horseback or foot which is both slow as shit i mean I'm curious to see if there's going to be any fast travel uh, through this game, which we may uh, learn a little bit later. But from what we're seeing, on at least on the PS4 Pro, because it has to be, because this video is rendered at 4K, um, it looks good. And I'm curious to see what, it, what it's going to look like on the X. Of course, PlayStation has the marketing right, so they're getting the, uh, th their gameplay will always be shown when this game is uh, uh, shown. But, man, um, I'm, I, I really need to play uh, Red Dead uh, Redemption on the, uh, the 360 one that's um, backwards compatible on Xbox um, and, and finish that game and just to, to prepare myself 
Um, I was never the biggest Red Dead fan. Um, but the thing about this game, or at least what it looks like, it looks like I don't even dare need, I don't, I'm not required to play Red Dead Redemption 1 to play this, being that this is a prequel. Um, so, I don't know, I mean, I, th I think it looks really, really good. Like, it's stuff like that, those card games, I'm, I'm not interested in, but, uh, with Rockstar Games, their Grand Theft Auto's, their Red Dead Redemption, it's full of, full of content, so... I'm just like the hours. I'm just curious on the hours required to get uh, through this game and the hours of content that they had um, they have for this game. And um, I'm curious on the PC announcement. But let me know, guys know what you think on this gameplay reveal in the comments below. I will talk to you guys later. As always, Xbox is the best box and I am the best bot. Good night or good morning or afternoon if you're on the other side of the globe. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Peace.